Hi, I'd like to share with you some ideas today on breaking up right-hand chords. We know how to break up left-hand chords pretty well through arpeggios and according patterns like that and so on. But in the right hand, what do you do with the right hand? Say, say that you come to a pause in the song where the note is held three beats or four beats or six beats, something like that. What do you do? Well, there's several things you can do. You can Let's say that the note that's held is C at the end of a phrase. Okay? You can take that uh, whole chord and just echo it by playing it up the keyboard like that. And that's probably the most obvious thing. Let's say, say I go like this. Okay, just playing it up the keyboard like that. Now, there's a better way to do it, though, and that's called a straddle. A straddle is where you leave out the middle note of any chord. So if you take this chord that I have, the C chord in, second, in first inversion, and leave out G, and just play C and E, it ha gives you an open sound. Then you go up to the next inversion of C, and the next inversion, and the next inversion. Let me put it in context. See there, it has that open sound. Now that's not the best fingering, however. The best fingering is to use two and five together and one and three. Like so, or coming down. Another thing you can do is called the two one breakup, where you, you have three notes in a chord and you, you play two, the top two, and then the bottom one. You can do that with a four note breakup too. You can take the top three notes, like if you're playing a C6 chord, you can play. You could also just have another chord in an octave higher, and another octave higher. You can do that. Or just the note itself. Or you could make a run out of, out of that chord. You can go. If you have a six chord like that, just make a run out of that coming down. You see what you do is you tuck your thumb under. Thumb under. Thumb under. Coming down it's just the opposite. You put your little finger over. It's kind of a jump but you need to do that. There's at least a half dozen ideas for breaking up chords in the right hand to fill up those empty spaces. So we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.